Hello, hello, hello. Come make a banner with me from scratch. So I bought this material at Hobby Lobby and now I'm ironing it, which was a bit tough just because um, it does. It's very delicate, I guess, with the heat. Um, so here I am sketching. I did do it a couple of times and then finally when I figure out what I want to do or where I want it positioned, then I go ahead and go with a white marker just so that I know where exactly I'm going to paint. And then I start, I started with a pink just so it'd be easier to, to transition it to a red and I needed help. So I had my brother come and help me fill in the, the biggest parts just because the material soaks up so much paint. Like, I don't even know how many coats of this I actually, of paint I had to add, but there was a lot, a lot of coats of paint. But here I go again. Um, for the white, I actually ended up using gesso instead of white paint. And it worked a lot better. Excuse the hair, this is how I woke up. Anyways, so I'm still working on the sign. Actually, I was working on it last night after church. And I fell asleep on the floor. Um, yeah. <laughs> and so then... I guess I woke up and I went to bed. I don't remember that, but. So here's what I have so far. So I just need to um, do another code of the UNLV and then add the class of 2021. After a few coats of more paint, I'm going to go ahead and start sewing up and finishing up the banner. So we're going to go ahead and top it off with the back piece, um, both right sides together. So I just sewed it all the way through, except I left a little bit right here so I can go ahead and flip it. So I'm just going to take off the alfileres. And excuse my hair. <laughs> I have to do my hair. I have to actually leave to work in about an hour. Um, so I'm just trying to finish this now. Okay. So then I left this opening so that I can. It's kind of like a. Probably should cut this. So you want to cut the edges, the little corners, see right here. And just all four sides. So then we're gonna flip it through very carefully. Okay, stop. Careful. Just like that. And now we're gonna stitch another around the whole thing. Now normally you would sew this, but since it's paint and since it's this material, I don't know if I really want to um, iron it, I mean. But yeah, so this is how it ends up and then you just sew it. Clean. And then where it's open, you just kind of fix it. See right here it's open, so you just kind of fix it and follow through with how it was. And then just sew through. And then we'll hide the back where some of the paint went through, as well as just the edges look a bit cleaner. I didn't, the edges were pretty good actually, but this will make it sturdier and not see through. And here we are. So I just have to take off the these little thingies, but I just sewed it all around. And so now it's clean. And the back, there's nothing in the back. So, and yay.
And that's how you make a banner. <laughs> Okay. Elizabeth Naomi Martinez Magna Ha, 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 ha.